We've got a lot of work to do to deliver on our promise of an outstanding game day experience. The CEO of the Winnipeg Blue Bombers called the football debut of Investors Group Field a disappointment from an operations perspective and acknowledged that much work is still to be done to eliminate issues that caused frustrations for many fans on Wednesday night. Garth Butchko addressed a media gathering at the stadium Thursday along with Vice President Jim Bell and Winnipeg Transit Director Dave Wardrop. Butchko took almost an apologetic tone in discussing Wednesday's debacle in which many fans arrived late for the game after being stuck in traffic for hours or waiting for buses that could fit them on. Football team didn't play well, disappointing on the field, but uh, we also are disappointed that we didn't we didn't give our fans everything that they deserve, which is great fan engagement and great service. Butchko said one approach to alleviating congestion on campus in the lead up to a game could be extending the hours fans would have access to the parking lots. As it stands now, lots don't open to the public until 90 minutes before kickoff. On Wednesday, that left any early arrivers out of luck for getting to their parking stalls. There's no guarantee that, but we're, we're talking to all stakeholders about every aspect of our game day operation. And one of that is working with the University of Manitoba to extend that time. Um, to, a, to a greater greater timeline. Wardrop said a management strategy anticipated some 5,200 riders of buses on game day. Instead, Transit's early estimations pegged that number closer to 8,500. I would encourage uh, folks to, to continue to give it a try. In reality, um, it, it's, it's the only viable way to, to really move people effectively in and out of the stadium in large volumes is, is, a, is an effective public transit system. Butchko said the club would be looking at all options on the table to try to help alleviate some of the concerns and hassles experienced in the preseason opener. June 27th, the Montreal Alouettes in town for the season opener is the next test. Reporting for the Winnipeg Sun, I'm David Larkins.